The observer pattern or publish subscribe pattern is so commonly used that the standard PHP library includes interfaces for implementation to create subject and observer classes. For our example, we've created a class called Sales Manager that implements the SPL subject interface. On line 25 through 41, we've implemented the required interface functions, attach, detach, and notify. On line 25, we've implemented the attach function. The function takes the handle to the observer object and stores it in an SPL object storage object that we create in the constructor. We'll see that in a moment. The detach method removes an attached observer object from the SPL object storage class variable. And the most important function, the notify function on line 35, iterates through the contents of the observer's SPL object storage object that is a class object and for each one of the observer object stored in that variable we call the update function on that observer object and pass ourselves the sales manager object to the observer object now our class is a sales manager so we have a private variable, new sale, declared on line 5. On line 6, we've declared our observers variable, which on line 10 in the constructor is assigned the handle to a new SPL object storage object. This observers object will store all of the observers of this subject. On line 13, we have a simple function, enter sale. Takes a new sale object and assigns it to the class variable new sale. And then calls notify. Notify tells observers something has changed in our subject. The state of our subject has changed. And then we provide a get new sale function so that the observer can get the new sale object from the sales manager. We've defined on line 44 a simple data class called sale. It has item code, customer ID, and the sale date as private variables. In the constructor, we pass two arguments, item code and customer ID, to record the sale. Then on line 54, we assign the current date to the sale date variable. And we provide assessor functions on 57 through 69. Now that we have our subject defined, here are the observers. We have an observer class called fulfillment that implements the standard PHP library observer interface, SPL observer. The only function that we are required to implement as part of the SPL observer interface is the update function. The update function takes a single argument of type SPL subject. We've done the same thing on line 11 and 19, creating an inventory control class, and a finance class. So we have three distinct observers of our subject, sales manager. And in each one of the update functions within these three classes, we're calling an echo statement to record the new sale and identify which class received the update call from the subject. So we drive these classes using this code. On line two and three, we include the files defining the classes. And on line five, six, and seven, we create new objects of our observer types. So we create a new fulfillment object, a new inventory control object, and a new finance object. 
On line 9, we create our subject, Sales Manager. On line 11, 12, and 13, we attach the observer objects to the subject by calling the attach method. Again, the attach method is declared in the SPL subject interface. We implemented it in our class Sales Manager. On line 15, we've created a new sale object. And the sale object requires an item number and a customer number as arguments, and we've provided those. Then on line 17, we call the sales manager's enter sale function passing the new sale object. When enter sale is called, the argument new sale is assigned to the private class variable new sale. And then on line 16, we call notify, which notifies all of the registered observers for this class. So let's run this and we'll see that a new sale was recorded in the fulfillment class, in the inventory class, and in the finance class. So when the update function was called from our subject, these are the update methods that were executed for each of the individual observer types. So all in all, the publish, subscribe, or observer pattern is a very simple pattern to implement, made even simpler by the availability of the interfaces SPL subject and SPL observer in the PHP library.